Hey Stewart's Chapel, Don Pearson here and Don Counts and we're at the Counts home. Very beautiful, comfortable home. Um, this is Thursday's devotion and um, we're still looking at our calling. This is a general calling. We are called, in my opinion, to shine. I, uh, a Christian, when if a, a Christian really doesn't have the option to shine or not to shine, uh, if they choose not to shine, then a Christian is actually living in rebellion uh, to the will of God for their life. In Matthew chapter 5, in the Sermon on the Mount, verse 16, Jesus said, Let your light so shine before men that they may see your good works and glorify your Father in heaven. Paul said something similar to that in Colossians chapter 3, verse 17. And whatever you do in word or deed, do all in the name of the Lord Jesus, giving thanks to God the Father through Him. If you've been a Christian at any length of time at all, you're very much aware that people are watching you, uh, especially friends and family that knew you before you became a Christian. They watch you. And every time you meet someone that they become aware that you're a Christian or you go to church, they watch you. Your life should bring them to a place where they give credit to God, where they glorify God, not you, not the good deeds you do, not give praise on you, but they give glory to God. That's what it means when a Christian shines. When a Christian does the things that God has called them to do in their following of Him, it should bring glory to the Father. One of the ways we shine the most is when we do what we do that the Father has called us to do with all that is in us, with an awareness that not only is He watching, but they are watching as well. I encourage you today to be mindful that the Father is watching you. He expects you to do everything you do to its very best. Not just, to give, not just to get the job done or the task done, but to give your very, very best. Not because your name is on it, but because God's name is on it. May, may others glorify the Father because you've chose to do your good works before men in a way that your light shines and gives glory to Him. Love you, Stewart's Chapel.